How's it going, E Tribe? Hope you all are doing great. This is E Vlog coming to you live, and welcome back on another episode on My Hero Academia Season 5, Episode 22. Now, the fight, the showdown between the League of the Villains versus Meta Liberation Army continues. But what I do want to point out is the fact that we did not get to see what transpired between Toga versus Kesaki. We did not get to see how she was able to defeat Kizuki. Now, some of you guys said to read the manga, but due to the fact that this is the anime that I want to react to and not read the manga, I think I'm going to digress it there. But feel free to let me know if the manga is still the best option to go for. Um, on that note, let's check out the next episode and see what took place. They created clones of... Oh, they got their hands on Toga as well. I got to say that the Metalibration Army Group did their research. They did their research before taking on the League of the Villains. Um, I wonder what the League of Villains are going to do to turn this around. I do not know, but there's always that slip chain because thus far they are... They are on top of the situation right now. Like it's that easy, right?
So he made a clone. He made clones of himself. It's good for us to see a little bit storyline on uh, Bobby Arroyd. Ooh. Ooh. They are about to... They're about to break her neck. They are about to break her neck. <laughs> Sad man's pride. He's no longer playing around. It's time for a massacre. Oh man. He's no longer holding back. Infinite doubles. Now I believe that they're going to turn things around. With those infinite doubles of his, they should be to. They should be able to turn things around. He's not done yet. Skeptic. So this guy named Skeptic is not done with his uh, actions yet. He still has other plans under his sleeve. Meanwhile, Dabi is busy fighting this guy.
Yeah, they should be able to turn things around because all the League of the Villains needs right now are uh, manpowers. He can actually extend the range of that eyes. Shinei. <laughs> It seems like the more the fight goes on, Dabi continues to burn up his energy and his quirk. Um, hopefully, he can be able to last longer than I, I, you know. Makia. <laughs> oh, Makia. He's out. Hmm. He can smell the master successor. <laughs> okay, finally, finally, finally. Uh, it looks like that doctor could have done this earlier, but he wanted to give them a chance to see what they can be able to do. Yeah, Machia is on his way. It seems like he created more after that. After what uh, Gitik or Gitak did to his previous clones. I dig the Shonen uh, epic background music that is playing right now.
That may be part of his quirk. Bobigra, one of Bobigra, Bobigra the clone has infiltrated this. Ooh. Is that a real Shigaraki or a cloned one? The question now is, would they have the same ability as the original copies of uh, Dabi, Jigaraki, and uh, the other guy? Sweet! Ooh. What is his ability? Counter counter attack or something? He just negated He just negated the attack like he was nothing. Hmm. <laughs> Thank you. 
Bam! With one touch. <laughs> with one touch. They took this tower down. Wow. <laughs> it seems like the fight is just getting started. The fight is just getting started. And remember that Machia is on his way here. Um, at this point, well, I mean, he's coming after uh, all for one's successor, which is uh, Shigaraki. But if he sees that someone is fighting Shigaraki, he's going to whoop that person's at. So, Redestro better watch out because very soon, soon enough, he will not be fighting only just Shigaraki. But I believe, though, I believe that Redestro might be stronger than Shigaraki. This is just my prediction. Um, because there are, me there are more to, to his power than meets the eye. Right, and it seems like what Shigaraki just did just pissed him off. Right now, he's angry, so we'll see how or the height of his power, what he can be able to do once he put his mind into something. And like I said before, let's not forget that soon enough <laughs> he will be fighting Shigaraki and Machia. Um, so we're going to see what the uh, uh preview on the next episode is going to be like Los Adra, okay? On the next episode, we're going to see that, uh, we're going to see a, a, a more side or we're going to see a storyline on Shigeraki. I think there's more to his storyline than, than that, that meets the eye. So we're going to see how this fight is going to turn out. And I, all I want is before Machia steps into this battlefield i want to see what shigaraki can be able to do with redestro and the other guy that speaks and each time he speaks the army right the metal liberation army gets more motivated and more energetic to fight they have to take care of that guy <laughs> they have to take care of him very 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 soon because if they don't like i said these guys have like two thousand uh, uh armies they have two thousand supporting it and um I think that they haven't gone through half of their uh, armies. So there is more of them out there. Uh, and in the beginning, I was expecting to see uh, how uh, Toga uh, escaped or how she defeated Kizuki. It seems like we're not going to get that on this episode. So on that note, feel free to let me know what you all think on the next on the comment box. And don't forget to... Uh, Pay attention to my community tab and also pay attention to my Discord, uh, to the general chat, because that's where I'll be releasing updates on my uh, upcoming uploads, especially uh, the ones that are not ongoing, like One Piece, like uh, The Seven Deadly Sins, uh, Get a Robo Arc, uh, The Beginning After the End, and other in, others in the future. So, stay safe. Keep on keeping on. <laughs>